what is up ladies and gentlemen we're back for yet another video haven't posted in quite some time but uh today we are out here we're doing some pond fishing my dad is right here and uh i'm gonna go quickly through what what i've got set up for today's fishing time we got a good old chatterbait right here um feeling that's gonna catch some we got a nice texas rig and then a guggen squad uh swim bait here my dad is <laughs> I don't know what he has tied on. He doesn't have anything Let's tied on, it looks like. <laughs> but this is, I believe, the first time um, fishing at this spot this year. Um, I've only, we actually haven't been fishing much lately, um, or even this year in general, just because I've been working and school and the whole pandemic and everything. Um, but uh, other than that, hope you, hopefully you guys are staying safe. And uh, we're going to get out on the water and uh, we're going to try to catch some fish. we got the GoPro chest mount on and uh, let's get after it. Going. First cast. First cast, fellas. Oh yeah, there we go. I've been recording for 28 seconds. And already got the first fish. <laughs> Look at that. I'm feeling like these fish are going to be moving up. Yeah. And like kind of along the bank because it's it's starting to be like the spawning time. And look at that. Choke the chatterbait. Just like, yeah. All right, you guys. Check that one out. Not a big fish at all. Um, but a solid one on the chatterbait. I've literally, well, now I've been recording for two minutes and five seconds. But... That is, that's crazy, crazy, crazy. All right, you guys, I'm just gonna kinda toss this guy back in there. Oh, there he goes. And just like that, we have caught the first fish of the day. Here is the chatterbait right here. I actually made this chatterbait up. Um, I had some heads left over um, and some blades and everything left over from when I used to, when I had my company. Uh, that sold chatterbaits and jigs and everything and I actually made that one up it might have been Thursday or so uh, when I made I think I made like four chatterbaits up and just put some like random uh, bluegill looking skirts on there first cast hit it mm. get ready fellas it's gonna be a good video all right guys my dad finally got one look at that there you go on the same same the chatter same chatterbait that I caught my first one. There you go. Nice little fish. First fish you get the year. release. Yeah, that's my dad's first fish of the year. So. All right. Well, I am still, uh, I'm still struggling out here. Also, my GoPro, for randomly, some reason, has low battery. Um... But, uh, yeah, so probably going to have to put that, put a charger on that boy. But uh, Chatterbait is working it today. Chatterbait is working, so I don't know. Maybe I'll have to steal back my rod, and my dad will have to put on a Chatterbait on his rod. So, I don't know. We're going to keep fishing. Got him. There we go. This boy came back for round two. There we go right there. He hit it the first time or just kind of like swiped at it and uh, I missed him. But uh, there we go. Nice fish. He is uh, he's quite muddy. But uh, there he is on the chatterbait. Just kind of choked it. So pretty sweet I'm gonna try to clean them off real quick alright you guys there we go second fish of the day for me like I was telling you he uh, he kind of hit it hit it once um, I popped it out of like a, a little grass patch and uh, he kind of like swiped at it and then um, and I missed him and he like flashed himself and uh, and then I cast right back in there I'm probably like five feet past him and then brought it through there 
kind of popped it again and then kind of hit that grass patch popped up popped, popped it out of there and uh, and then he hit and uh, there we go second fish of the day and uh, on the on the chatter bait that I made probably three days ago so uh, pretty sweet all right guys I'm gonna release this fishy gonna kind of bring him down here and uh, give him a good old toss and he is off so that is pretty sweet that's fish number two for me so I, I guess I did not have the uh, first cast fish little curse deal but on the chatterbait and uh, I'm gonna get back after it got another one all right guys fish number three on the day and uh, oh yeah it's a decent one too I think it is oh yeah there we go that is fish number three on the chatterbait and uh, he hit it solid once again not very big um, actually kind of skinny but uh, uh, kind of pretty decent fish again like like I said on the chatterbait and uh, he almost hit it as soon as it hit the water so that is a uh, that is something else. Fish number three on the day for me. And uh, we're rolling with the chatterbait, fellas. Alrighty, I'm going to release them back. Here we go. Here's kind of like a little step down. There we go. Fish number three. And uh, we're going to get them off. Kind of got to toss them a little bit out. But there we go. Almost, it almost seemed like he hit, he hit my bait like as soon as it hit the water. So... That was something. Also, it's kind of out, out over there by that tree, and uh, I bet he was probably a little male on a bed. So that's pretty sweet. Starting to move up. I, I had a feeling after that first fish, uh, that bit like 15 feet away from the bank, that I was. I had a feeling that they were going to be starting to push up and getting more shallow, and we were going to start catching them like kind of in and near beds and kind of near some brush and kind of closer to the bank also but that one was kind of over there by that bank but anyways good fish that one there we go fish number four on the day there we go fellas just like that. Got some grass in him. Grass in his mouth. Not this fish. The other fish needs a break. Just bring that good old chatterbait right along this grass patch. I'm going to try to get some of this grass out of his mouth down here. Alright. Well, there we go. There's fish number four for the day. And a uh, decent little guy. All right, fish number four, we're going to get him back, and off he goes, and uh, I don't know what it is about this chatterbait, but they are just, you know, really liking it today. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I should try to switch colors to show you all something else, but I mean, I'm having fun, so, and I'm sure you guys are enjoying the fish catches, so. You know, I will just uh, leave it at that. I'm going to get back after it and uh, try to catch some more fish. Alrighty, guys. Well, we are going to end it today. Dad and everything is packed all up. Um, this is the bait that caught every fish today. This little guy right here is just a, uh, it's just a chatterbait that I made, actually. Um, with uh, I, I made it all together, put the skirt on there, and... I don't know just something about you know like making your own baits and um, well, I don't make them anymore but making your own baits and going out and catching fish on them and I mean good decent quality fish on them as well um, is it's just like so rewarding that's why I fish with like chatter baits so much because it's one of they're one of the baits that uh, I make 
and um, I don't know I just have a, a real fun time making them fishing with them catching fish on baits that I make I don't know it's just super rewarding um, but other than that the bass were uh, it kind of slowed down it kind of picked up a little bit and I think I caught like two or three maybe um, like all like in a close time I guess you could say um, but we we came out here I think we spent a couple out a couple hours out here today I caught four fish my dad caught one and uh, other than that, that's about it for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. And uh, now that, I mean, school's kind of out right now, just because the whole corona thing. Um, but I'm gonna try to get out on the water as much as I can. Hopefully the weather's gonna start being nice. And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys are staying safe, uh, spend time with your families. And uh, other than that, thank you guys for watching. And I will catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys.